everyone and welcome back to another of my uh, tours this time I'm doing a voice commentary and it's uh, just one building not the whole settlement I hope it will be still interesting enough for you so this is a house of Preston Garbis I made and uh, I wanted to convey that it's a bit junky because it's a, a you know settlement it's not nothing uh, really professional but it's uh, it for him for s someone who lives alone but who is uh, really dedicated to his work it is situated in to the entrance uh, to sanctuary so he can guard it from any invasion or any other attackers which is which goes with his character i think so we have it at night and even though there are a lot of some th things around the whole building we will first go inside to see what's up there and then we will switch today and we will see what's outside too so here's the entrance and uh, Preston is already here so hi Preston I see that you've done your homework I give you and I hope you took something from it so uh, this area it's a uh, both a living room and an office there's some storage for him and you know, equipment he can take with him with him when he's going at the minute's notice to help some settlement also there are stairs uh, that leads up and we will get there eventually but for now let's stay down uh, on the left side you will see his uh, office table where he's doing all his research for all those settlements that need your help it's uh, I wanted to make it decorated uh, decorated enough and to so that every item will shows us its use and it's some story behind it and this is his uh, combined dining area and the kitchen it's small from a point of view that there's just a small table with two chairs because I don't think he has lots of visitors here and also there's not so much of the decoration so because I think he's not the type to overdo it but it's uh, stock well enough I, I think and here's the bathroom it's a uh, I uh, it's a place that has all the enemies for him there's a uh, a sink that I made from a large cat ball and a water pump because I wanted to make it special. Also, here's some some like a window outside that still gives him some privacy because it's high enough. Uh, another another thing here is that he has a, a washing machine to clean all his uniforms, which is something I guess he would be uh, quite fond of. Uh, next we will go upstairs where is the rest of the uh, inside building there's a nice view even from here but it will get better soon this is uh, this is just a small hall that leads to his uh, bedroom and also outside but first we will see where our great friend sleeps don't worry just nothing bad about it <laughs> so uh, here's some stuff I, I placed radios in every major room because I think he would like to listen to Radio Freedom for any notice everywhere he, where he is so this was the bedroom and now we will head outside where I made a stairs that lead to a small watchtower he has to see any other attack from you know, more directions than just out outside. Here's it. There is not so much of a great view right now because this is the first uh, serious build I did at Sanctuary, but more is to come. So we will 
have a small uh, small look around the whole house so we will see how it looks from all the sides for now uh, you can also notice that there's the generator outside it's it's sheltered so it shouldn't have any problem with weather but I wanted to make, give it to place it outside so it would not you know get in the way anywhere also I try to work with lighting a lot as I try to in most of my builds because I think a good lighting is very important for a build which you can also see on the the statue that's above the entrance of a Minuteman so he, it's, it's lit from down to make it imposing so we will switch to the day so we will see more now do another look around the house and then we will look at the outside in more detail there are lots of Minutemen flags and other decorations to really sell the idea it's for someone as uh, dedicated as Preston is so the outside porch uh, consists of two main areas on the right there is a dog house for dog me who I guess really often visits Preston or maybe even sleeps here and there is a small table where Preston can relax or have a breakfast outside also some flowers are here but I don't think he's much of a gardener just a, something to make it more nicer there's a cannon and some other stuff to make it thematic but it's just for fun and here on the left there's a small shooting range which Preston uses to hone his skills And that is all for now. I know it's not the biggest build, but I think it has enough in, uh, character, and it, I'm quite happy how it looks from the outside. It's first step in making something nice out of sanctuary. Maybe I will do more in the future. But for now, I thank you for watching, and have a great day. Bye.